Gaffer feels like the fair result. Yeah, to be honest with you, after 20 minutes, uh, we were fortunate it was only 1-0. Is the the truth of the matter? You know, we we worked our shape, we worked our framework. But I've said to them time and time again that when you're in the shape, the shape doesn't you know stop the goals. It's how hard and intensely you work in that shape. And in the opening 15, 20 minutes, we were very passive in the shape. We weren't aggressive in the game. We allowed them to to get the head up and pick the passes at times where we should have really been there. Uh, you know, in their face, shall I say? So. After that, we began to get contact. We grew into the game, but probably at half time, the, the the result, you know, reflected the game itself. Second half, I thought we were very good. I thought we played the type of football, the intense football that I want to see us play, and that was a great, real difference. You know, intensity, getting up to the game. You know, really intense in the press and breaking quickly with some really good bits of football um, as well. So in the end, I think it was a fair result. Um, and to be honest with you, with two very good teams, I believe, you know, you have to give them credit. They're a very good side. I watched them last week against MK Dons and they, they, do, uh, they do play the game very well and they're, they're a, a very well organised side. So, you know, I'm, I'm disappointed because for me, I want us to win all our home games. This has to be a place that we win our games at. But the one thing I said to the players is, when you don't, when you don't win, you don't lose, and that was an important factor for us. We showed a good mentality in the game. Well, opening 15 minutes is that as a manager where you're tearing your hair out because you know that they're better than that. Of course, but the players know that. You know, I, I said to them at half time, and they know that. And that's the frustration of it. We were just a little bit tentative. You know, we showed them that respect um, that that we really didn't need to do but uh, we are reacted positively and I have to you know commend the players on that because when you go 1-0 down at home to a good side like that it's not easy but our reaction was terrific so really pleased in the end to to get the point um, and really pleased that we keep the run going you know it's important that we we don't lose these types of games we were just saying before you came in the positive aspect of all this is the fact that the lads didn't fold they worked their way back into the game a million percent and you know I thought it was a really strong second half performance against the wind the ironic thing is there was quite a win today and both sides played better against the wind for some reason uh, but you know against the wind we, we played really well we played high energy football and uh, that's the type of performance in the second half that I expect from us Mickey Law's free kick there's nothing you can do about that disappointed with the way it was conceded yeah of course but I think the, the, the way it was conceded you know pretty much reflected how we'd started in the first 15-20 minutes of games uh, sorry today's game but uh, after that you know, I thought we grew into it, and especially as I've said, the second half. The second half was a real positive performance from us, and I, I thought it was an exciting performance, a performance of intensity where you can feel the supporters getting behind the team because of it. So, you know, that was that was really pleasing. You said before your message to the players is, is your message that stays private, but there was a, it seemed to be a flick, a switch flicked during that first half team talk. Whatever it was that was said, the, the positive response that you got. Yeah, but I said to them before the game that, you know, we'd brought in five or six really good level players in the transfer window that had brought a real optimism about the club and a real feeling that we could achieve something. But we've got to keep that going and we can only keep that going by performances and results. You know, nothing else will, will get the supporters behind the team more than that. So the feel-good factor, we have a responsibility to keep that going. And uh, I think the supporters will go away today pretty optimistic about what they've seen, especially in the second half. Thanks.